The past few days has been an experience, an eye-opener, but this is my side of the story. Earlier this year, I think February, we were contacted, a friend contacted me and said, hey, Royal Housewives um, is coming to Abuja, and I feel, you know, we need the Northern touch. You know, yes, Abuja is cosmopolitan, but we need core Northern ladies. And I was very excited. It was time for us to show our culture, the rich culture of the North, the North that people don't know, um, our, our culture, our traditions, our religion, everything. Um, I was excited. So I mobilized some women and I said, some of my friends, hey, are you interested? Some were and some weren't. But the ones that were jumped on it. And we went back and forth with um, the producers until, I think, June. Two days before, they said, oh, hey, we're in Abuja. We're here to shoot the audition for this thing. And we were all excited. We all glammed up and we went um, to the shoot. But on the day of the shoot, there were things I personally wasn't too comfortable with. And after the shoot, the next day, after you know discussing with my husband, I categorically called her and sent her a message and said, hey, I'm pulling out for some reasons left to me. And she said, okay, she wasn't too happy, but she said, okay, no wahala. And we, we parted ways. And I, I, I guarantee you I've forgotten about the show. Of course, I've been seen here and there, but I have forgotten. <laughs> I've moved on with my life. I'm doing so many th different things. Only for on the 2nd of June, um, August, my phone started ringing. Aisha, inna lillahi wa inna ilayhi raju. Inna lillahi, God forbid, this, 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 that, that. I was like, ah, what is happening? Because how people saw it, that's how I saw it, trending on social media. I checked, I'm like, ah, why am I on this? And I called her. And she said, oh, it's a licked video. I said, but why am I on it? Because two days after, I said, I don't want to be part of this. But anyway, um, you know, it has caused a lot of controversy. We jumped on it, or I rather jumped on it because I had the impression that it was going to showcase my culture, my tradition, the Lafayas, the Meduguri dance, the, you know, do you know that Kaduna alone has over 400 languages no because a lot of nigerians don't even know the north but regardless we are still open to showcase how beautiful our family units are how beautiful our royal families are how beautiful our men and women are the culture the diversity the religion every single thing and i feel it's time for us to tell our story like imagine America sat down purposely and told their story. And that's why we felt like they're the greatest um, nation in the world. We are great, but who would tell our story? We have to tell our story. The rich people in the North need to finance for us to tell our stories by ourselves. And you know, this is my truth. I want to sincerely apologize to my family, to the community, and to the North at large. It was not our intention to give this impression. Regardless, the story of the North needs to be told.